Hello and good afternoon to all of you. It is now Monday, November 27th. Uh, I have not done a video in a while because, uh, frankly, I've been trying to recover from Black Friday weekend. I was terrible. Uh, I definitely did damage to my body. Um, I am pushing myself faster to my grave, so it was not fun. <laughs> anyway, I've survived. I slept nine hours last night, so I feel slightly well-rested. I'm thankful for that. I'm also thankful that I did not get sick being around five bajillion people over the weekend as well, too. Um, anyway, uh, today's video uh, is a box from Amazon. I bought an item that's very strange that I discovered recently. Apparently there is a uh, pumpkin head boxing nun figure that you can buy on Amazon. Now it's from the uh, Syndicate Collectibles group. I'm not sure if you guys were familiar, but when there was the, uh, I think the uh, San Diego Comic-Con, they did reveal a few uh, figures, which there's a pumpkin head figure in the works, um, ghoulies, all kinds of fun stuff. The quality looks really good and could potentially rival NECA, so we'll see about that. Um, Trick or Treat Studios, I think, is also doing a pumpkin head figure as well, which is cool because there's really not a lot of pumpkin head merchandise floating around their other world. I think I uh, bought the blanket recently and then this hat from Inked Up Merch which the hat's fantastic. I love this hat. Um, besides that, there's just the Movie Maniacs uh, figure, and there's the uh, Soda Toys uh, Big Boy, which uh, that's that's one of my Holy Grail ones. On eBay, that thing goes for like four to 500 bucks. I've, I've eyeballed it many times, but I, I can't justify that much money right now. <laughs> um, and I think Sideshow has a $1,300 big statue, which, uh, that's too expensive and I don't have the space for it, so. But the, the soda figure, I definitely want to get my hands on that one, so. Without further ado, though, let's get into this. Now, if you guys do want to help my uh, ass out, because let's be realistic, all this collecting stuff is very expensive. Um, this guy right here, you can purchase him through my little link I'm going to put right there. So if you got to get yourself one of these uh, pumpkin head boxing horror reacher things, I'm going to show you what it looks like. Uh, please get it through my link. So there we go. Let's open this up and see what it looks like. How the quality is. This thing guy ran about 40 bucks, which, eh, a little expensive, but it's good. Uh, packaged horribly, of course. It's the joy of ordering from Amazon, but I looked online and this is the only place I could find it. The Syndicate website's actually not even up yet, so I don't even know how this company got a hold of it, but. Here it is. Ooh, that is beautiful. Look at that thing. It is big. Uh, generally, I don't take things out of the box, but uh, today I'm going to. I'm gonna open it up. It just looks too good to keep uh, sealed up, so. Uh, let's see, how does this work? All right, so. Strangely enough, you would think it would open from this side, but it actually opens from the side panel right there. But let's let you see the thing here. There's the back, some words. And that's the company right there, Syndicate Collectibles, if you can see that. Not really, but whatever. You get the point. All right, let's see. Oh, and I also forgot to mention the pumpkin head shirt, of course, too, which came from Middle of Beyond. Now I've covered all of my things. This is really, uh, Quite the feat to break him out of his cardboard prison. All 
All right. Here we go. Hands look great. I don't really, I know he has these little things on top, but they look like nut sacks. Just, just saying. All right, let's see. Yeah, I don't know. It's fun. I enjoy this. I'm really happy. It's a pumpkin head collectible, so it's great. It reaches. Look at that. It's like a typing thing or a keyboardist. There we go. Do 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 do. But yeah, I like I said, the quality on this one works great. There is also a killer clown one that you can get as well, uh, which I don't need. I have enough killer clown some outer space merch as it is. So. But the head sculpt on that looks fantastic, and the hands look great too. So uh, overall, I'm super happy with this item. Uh, gonna put him back in his little cardboard prison now. And uh, hope a few of you go, ooh, I gotta get my hands on that and go through that link because that would be super awesome. Anyway guys, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and uh, I hope you survived this week. Last week was a, was a rough one. I'm just going to say right now. Thanksgiving was nice, but uh, what came after that? Ugh, not good. Anyway, all right. Thanks for watching, and uh, till next video, and uh, click that link. All right.